that raised right. any red flags for me. Right, I so, feel that. Yeah, asked him about the relationship, what was going on there, if there was something at all. Um, and he said that they were just friends, everything was cool, you know. Um, so. What well, does your friend say? Like they flirt a lot, or how does? Well, let me just be honest. She's bi. Um, so. What well, does your friend say? Like, is he like a mix of Jalen Hurts and Dak Prescott? That's immediately what I saw when I saw his face. Like, like the top half of his face is Dak Prescott and like the bottom is Jalen Hurts. They flirt a lot or how does... Well, let me just be honest. She's biased because she's on my team. So yeah, she she really does she, make so it seem... You know, like she bit, does... Yeah. yeah, she says they flirt all the time. They take their lunches together. And on their lunch, it's not like, hey, like, oh, you happen to be eating lunch? Let me sit down. It's like, let's go take our lunches together, right? And then yeah. multiple times, like, okay, one little lunch, whatever, right? Yeah. But then it's like, Tyson. if I'm hearing, like, this is a consistent thing, like, y'all yeah. are, what the f is this, you know? Yeah. Crown wanted to test her boyfriend's loyalty because she's been very suspicious of him talking to or cheating on her with his co-worker. Well, technically his now ex-co-worker. You see, Sean eventually left that job, but he's still hanging out with the old co-workers and talking to that girl. He got fired from and I was low-key happy because it was like, okay, now you don't got to deal with the girl. But then I found- Low-key happy that I got fired with, with a girlfriend like this who needs enemies. I'm not like, he's hanging out with the old coworkers. He's going to bars with them. Oh, wow. All type of like that. And she's there. Is, she, is he inviting you, though, to and go out? And he's not inviting me. No. Mm. And you know for a fact that when he goes out and hangs out with the coworkers that she's there? Yeah. Have you met her before? I never met her. Mm. Did you think to confront her ever? Like? Yeah, but at the same time, it's like, if I don't know anything for certain, I can't just, you know what I mean? Mm. And it's really not her. I'm, I'm not, I don't have an issue with her. For sure. You know, for as much as I know, she don't even know he's in a relationship. Mm. But it's him. Yeah. Mm. He needs to understand that you're in a relationship right. and that's just not how you operate, you know? And you said that one of the Colin reasons why- you gonna yap for, god damn. Like, okay. Whatever you feel like will tempt him. Come on, bro. Let's get to it. Let's get to the action. Please give us the whole, the whole backstory. There's a family right. in our driveway. Like you know? Good. After waiting for another 30 minutes or so, Sean had finally arrived. There we go. Come on, Sean. Oh, yeah. This is so Let's cool. lock in. Hello? Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm outside. Okay. Uh, can you come to the door and I'll come grab you? All right. Sounds good. Okay. Is that his car? I think. I couldn't even see. He drives a black car. Madeline makes her way to the front door to greet Sean. She carries a glass of champagne in her hand. Oh, he's coming. Oh, All right, y'all. Game face. The idea is that Madeline's been day drinking, celebrating the release of her new music. So her job is to act a little tip. Wait, she got, she actually got music? The idea is that Madeline's been day drinking, celebrating the release of her Made line Monet, Monet. Hold on, we got to see what that's about. Um... Uh... Nice little, nice little calm plug. Let's see. This is vibey already, already. I can hear this in J C Penney's right now. Vibey. I like how we set this up. The way you love me, baby. I don't understand. I let you steal my heart. Cause it's safer in your hands Even when times get crazy I know you're more than a maybe That's why I'm always saying It's only She sounds really good. Travel the world in the seven seas. You can believe that you found me. All I need you and me. Nah, she's tough. She's tough. She's For new tough. music. So her job is to act she's a little tough. tipsy. She's tough. She's tough. She's hey. Actor, singer, model. She's going crazy right now. How are you? Madeline. What was your name again? Sean. Sean. Come on in. Thank you. 
Okay, here we go. Here we, go. we got him over. That's good. That's a good Where's first the charger? Step. Sorry, that took so long. I was Where's the charger? getting more champagne, and I'm here with my team right now. This is Sean, guys. He's here to get a charger. Madeline introduces Sean to her supposed team. Her music producer, Nathan, and her manager, Kyle. If you guys recall, to narrow down his arrival time, Madeline told Sean that she had a meeting with them that would wrap up by the time that he got there. Congratulations on your new project, on your drop. I'm really excited to see that. I'm going to send you some more beats tonight, too. Oh, yeah. I have, like, two more for, like, the next project. Let me yes. know what you think of them. I chefed up a little bit. And then I'll call yeah, you later here. with the numbers and how much everything's going to cost. Okay, sounds so good, guys. Nathan and Kyle fulfilled their jobs. A small role, but critical in getting Sean over at a certain time and also making sure that the rest of this test would be believable. I wish I knew island. that Crown was sending such a hump to come over island. to get this charger. I would have gotten <laughs> ready island. a little bit more. Thanks. Would you like a drink? I'm good. Okay. I'm gonna put this away then. <laughs> I'd be Ask about the charger. Ask. Bro. Niggas don't got shit to do. Like, I don't have time to just be in here. Like, I'm, I got shit to do, bruh. You feel me? Even, especially having a girlfriend. Like, now that I don't talk to nobody, I have mad time to do what I want to do and get shit done. Having a girlfriend and she having you run errands, bro, I... I need to be I out roll, of here. You feel me? Seconds. I'm not just a decoy out here. He probably thinks I make the virus beats in the world, bro. All right, cool. Whatever. It's fine. He believes it. Uh, I usually don't date drinks, but we're celebrating. We're celebrating. And celebrate. I mean, I I don't know. You could. Can you keep a secret? I really want to tell you. I really want to tell you. But you have to keep a secret. Okay. You have to pinky swear. Pinky sure. swear. Okay. I'm one of these. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> She's actually comp though. She's actually applying quality pressure. She's not doing too much, but she's. Letting it feel, you know, letting it come natural, you know, slowly escalating, breaking the touch barrier. She's actually really good. Hey, man. Whisper in my ear. Come on, that's, I'm, I might already be halfway there. My first single on my tonight. And it's R&B. Tailgate's a better with Sam Adams Oktoberfest. Maybe I am a morning person. It's Sam season! Really cool. Yeah. Nice. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Cheers. I'm literally like so excited about this. I can, I can tell. <laughs> Would you be down to hear a song? Where the fuck is the charger? You know what? Actually, no. You hear a song. You tell me what you think. Cause I would love to have your opinion, and then I will give you the charger. It's like that. It's like that. Oh All right. She's comp. I don't know who. I don't know if this is improv. Or if this is a script, but either way, bruh, she's going crazy. I need some extra ears on this, you know? I can spare some time. Yeah. And it looks like I don't have a choice anyways. So <laughs> okay, let me just... Give me this charger, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Get right some more of this real quick. You sure you don't want to drink? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. You sure? Okay. The next step of our plan would give us access to Sean's phone. Madeline just needed to execute it flawlessly. Are you positive that the password on his phone is still the same? I'm not positive, but I, I'm pretty almost. Okay. I should be shit. Okay, the. Oh, wait. Do you have your phone on you? Yes. Okay, can you leave it there, please? Why? Because I don't want you to, like, be secretly recording and then possibly leak my new song. What am I. I'm not gonna leak I, I'm sorry. I just don't trust you like that. This is pissing me off. I don't trust it like that. Please, just leave it right here. Give me the charger! Please. I'm so serious. I don't give a fuck about your song like that, bro. Happy. Give me the charger uh, so I can spin. Oh, what's that? It's my wallet. Chill. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. What do you think it was? Honestly, you don't want to know. <laughs> Come on in. She's Madeline cooking. takes Sean into the office, closing Why the door behind her. We can sit here. I have a speaker over here. Okay. Let's let them start the music. A seemingly paranoid and tipsy Madeline successfully manages to convince Sean to leave his phone behind so that he wouldn't leak any of her new music. In reality though, we simply wanted the crown to have access to his phone. These songs, this whole project is based around a love interest. This one's acoustic though. Got her music started. Yes, let's go. Oh my God. On top of seeing if Sean would cheat with Madeline, we also wanted to help Crown There's find out what the plug. relationship between Sean and his ex coworker was. Her name is Evelyn. Are she and Sean really just friends, or are they something more? I mean, remember, guys, Evelyn was the whole reason why Crown wanted to do this test in the first place. We had to give her some sort of closure. You ready for this? We're live. We're, we're live. You sure about this? Positive about this? Yeah. yeah Once we, we do this, there's no going back. I know. There's no going back. Once we do this. The way you love me, baby. You gotta be quick. This song. I don't understand. 
that we should have followed Sean and Evelyn around and found out if they were hooking up. Remember how his phone is, okay? We considered it, but in the end, we didn't want to spend possibly weeks stalking them to hopefully catch them in the act. Next time, we'll send Nathan, though. It'd be better just to kind of catch them in the act of doing that. How do we have two weeks to go spy on these people? Don't you have anything better to do with your time? Literally, don't you have anything better to do than to listen to this bitch new song and shit like that? I came here for the Charger. This, is not, this was not even a part of my day. This is literally my off day. I have 24 hours to make the most of my off day. And I'm and I'm in your crib looking and, and trying to debate for a charger. I definitely do, but I'm invested. I see these stars, I see them. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's the same. And just like that, we were into Sean's phone. Oh, now, we didn't want Crown cool. to go through it. We simply wanted her to change her name with Evelyn's, delete both of their message threads, and then text Sean something with, hey, babe. Dot, dot, dot. We would then get Sean to look at his phone and he would hopefully think that it's Evelyn. His response to that text would tell Crown everything she needs to know. You don't have to read anything if you don't want to. Hey, Evelyn, but he's an Eva. Eva? Eva? He's an Eva. There's no Evelyn. Interesting. He's an Eva. Is it her? Surprisingly, Crown couldn't find an Evelyn in his phone. All she found was an Eva, which could have been short for Evelyn. That one's you. Oh, so ah, you like it? <laughs> this one's called Gotta Have It. So it was like my third favorite. Bro, Madeline is continues. This an album listening party, bro. One song, I right, cool. Like maybe I give you like yo, I got a new song. Just hit, listen to it real quick. Just real quick on some CD shit. Yo, real quick. All right, let me hear it. You got me listening to a whole album. Playing more music to buy us more time. They we talk like they have phone conversations. What the. F Let's see, okay, but do you see how some of these, I think he's deleting shit because do you see how like some of these are getting, there's so many gaps. Like he said this yesterday, right? Then the last message oh, is Thursday. In trying to figure out if this was or wasn't Evelyn, Crown inevitably ended up reading some messages. I didn't want to show them because I wasn't sure if this was even his ex coworker, but their thread was interesting. There were gaps between messages. To give you guys a visual example, here's a message thread between me and my friend. You notice the gaps between our texts? Our thread looks like this because we hardly text each other. We communicate more through voice messages or just call each other. So Sean and this Eva girl didn't text each other very frequently, or Sean was deleting messages. <sighs> See, like there's so many gaps. And clearly, they, they be talking. He's deleting. Shit. He's deleting all this. Shit. See, like it's like he's deleting messages. So like they're talking so much. Are you sure this is Evelyn? Evelyn? Oh, I think I, I know, it's gotta be. I don't blame Cran for assuming the worst. I mean, we're filming a loyalty test after all. The reality though, is that Sean may not be deleting messages. That doesn't mean that he and this girl aren't communicating in some other form though. I'm good, I'm done. I see, I saw enough. So switch Ava's name to my name? Yeah, once you do it, there's literally like no one back. Like he's gonna know yeah. what you did eventually. He's gonna figure it out. Crown was convinced that Eva was short for Evelyn and that Sean was deleting messages, so she moved forward with our plan. And just delete your thread too. Oh yeah. And with that, our mission was accomplished. All we had to do now was send Sean that text. By the way, shout out to Madeline for holding him there. She actually did drop some new music, guys. That was a part of the test, but not an act. Go check it out and download it now. So this one's actually like, oh yeah, I could tell that she's got a little freak in it. Mm. Everyone gotta have a little you freak in it. <laughs> My heart is pounding. Oh my gosh. You think he's deleting? Yeah. Or you think they could also be like voice chatting or like they're communicating like in some other form, like maybe it's like a phone call or something or Snapchat or something. And then... I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I should have checked all his apps. <laughs> Uh, a part of me honestly felt bad, guys, because Crown had held off so long in not going through Sean's phone, and our plan low-key made it go through his phone. Now we had her in her head about even more things. Maybe it's gonna turn out to be nothing, though. Maybe Eva isn't even Evelyn. Either way, uh, just the fact that they're, like, texting back and forth. Yeah. I don't know how to feel right now. Oh, we should probably just prepare the text that you're gonna... Oh, it's okay. Um, okay. I'm gonna say, hey, babe. Um, what you doing tonight? 
Maybe not the tonight, because Madeline's about to ask oh, him why. Oh, yeah. So, hey, babe, what you doing? So he might get suspicious. Okay. Don't tell me yet, though. I'll let you know when it's in. Just hold on to it, yeah. I swear to God, if he responds something like... Ideally, this nigga, bro. he should say... Who the f oh, babe? Who I already can tell this nigga don't stand on business, bro. You're sitting here listening to an album that I know you don't give a fuck about. Like, you might like... He might want to fuck on her, and, like, that might be the reason he's listening to all this shit, but... Bro, give me the charger and get me out of there, bro. I don't care. You mean to text this or yeah, like you yeah. got the wrong number, you know, like. He better respond, babe, who the f he's mad? It's something along those lines, right? I hate this nigga. Ah, thank you. Hey. Please tell me you like it. Please tell me, I need validation. Like, it's so good, honestly. Like, I really like them, Daniel. Really? Yeah. You're just saying that. Oh, well, okay. You're just saying that because you want your charger back. Oh, you're actually really talented. Uh, I would listen to that. Yeah, he said he's a fan. Hey, 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 hey. winning hearts, winning souls. Hey, hey, hey. hey. <laughs> <laughs> I was only supposed to show you one song. It's okay. Uh, I mean, I gotta get you out of here. <laughs> Let me get that charger for you. Okay, prepare to send the message. He's gonna grab his phone right now. Um, I think it's in the living room though. Kitchen. Oh. Maybe we go check to see if it's over here. Thank you so much, though, for taking the time. I know you're probably busy. Do you have any plans later? Um, no plans. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Hold on. We're not done here. I just want to make sure you're not. Oh. Oh. Okay, I think you go, this is your phone. Yeah, this is your phone. You got a text from Ava. Check your schedule too, but I have to use the restroom. So give me a second. I'll be back. Oh, yeah, perfect. And so with that, our plan was done. Crown sent the text, Madeline made sure that he saw it, and now all we had to do was wait for his response. Is he texting? There's no doubt about it. Sean saw the text. The question was, what would he reply? Okay, I'm not gonna pee. I don't want you all to hear me. I really have to pee though. <laughs> Sean was on his phone, but no text was coming through. Any response? He's not responding. No, he's just looking at it like. You think he's catching on? Hmm. He could. At the same time, like, I don't. This man really went radio silent. I mean, you deleted both of the text message threads. So if I open my phone and both of my text message threads are deleted from the two girls I fuck with, I'm gonna be thinking like, yo, sign is off. Like where the fuck is the rest of our messages? That's what I'm gonna be thinking. Honest. Like he's on his freaking phone, man. And I might check the number. Like this plan is like for dumb niggas. That, that would never work against a nigga who has any level of IQ. Once you see something is off, you left your phone in a place that you shouldn't have left it. And now, you know, I, I would have probably noticed you put my phone in the wrong spot. The thread is, is not there. I'm suspicious now. Now, a girl that's calling me. Like, even if they do talk, she probably don't call him babe. Like, you feel me? So then, like, okay, why is she calling me babe? There's too much suspicious shit going on. So let me not make any moves. Let me just sit back and just... Make a read. You know what I'm saying? When you in the pocket, right? You don't want to panic. You want to step up into your protection, have good pocket, trust your old line, and make a good decision. You feel me? Madeline pointed out the message. He saw it. He read it. You got me thinking about family. <laughs> Probably on social media or something. He's seriously not texting him. He's not texting back. He is seriously not. He's on his phone. That's what I'm saying, he saw it. He's on his phone, he's not. He's like, I know you saw that. <sighs> Come on, Sean, give us something. Even if it's an emoji or a confused question mark, something to tell us the dynamic between you and this other girl's relationship. No. Prove us wrong about you, now is your chance. Something is wrong. Okay, I'm really gonna go pee though, guys, cause I gotta go. <laughs> I really thought he was gonna text back. The only reason I can think of him not responding is that he's suspicious of it because there's no other messages. Exactly. He thinks that he deleted the thread. Mm. That's true. I didn't think about that. Madeline is peeing. So maybe he's like, 
suspicious about that, but... Man, I really thought we were going places with this plan, but unfortunately not. Sean didn't text back a thing. Madeline gave it three to five minutes before going back outside. More than enough time to take a piss and for this man to reply. I thought we were going places. I really, really did. Oh my God. I had a, maybe a little bit too much champagne. <laughs> so sorry about that. We may never learn the dynamic between him and this Eva or Evelyn girl. I mean, if they're even the same person, but at least we are gonna learn if he would be willing to go on a date with Madeline, which honestly still says a lot. By the way, just so you guys know, this was completely unplanned. The fact that you guys are matching. I know. <laughs> that was literally down to the foot. Down to the foot, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No free toes though, no free toes. How much you charging for the toes? I'm gonna have half a glass more. Gotta keep the party going. We're we are. <laughs> we are so, so did you get a chance to check your schedule? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm down to like hang out. I I'll be done like around eight. Okay. Maybe we can meet like at nine. Yeah. I mean, what do you want to do though? You want to stay here or you want to go out? Uh, probably just stay here. Have some more champagne. And we can like. Honestly, bro, I feel like he just. He's just mad passive. Like, I feel like he don't know how to say no. I feel like that's low-key what it is. I feel like he don't know how to say no. So he's just like, okay. Do you want to hear some music? Okay. Do you want to go on a date? Okay. Like, I'm going to hold you hostage for a charger. Okay. Like, he just don't. He's just mad laid back. Chill in the jacuzzi. I, I do, yeah. <laughs> I also have um, a few other songs I could show you. So maybe oh. I feel like for this, bro, like that's already a fail. That's done. There was no hesitation. That means this, he's doing this all the time. The fact that Sean was down to hang out with zero hesitation does say a lot. He probably already sensed Madeline subtly flirting with him and he was with it. Maybe this is why he didn't text anything back. Well, I mean, it's none of my business, but who is Eva? Whoa, whoa. Yo, shorty, chill. That's inappropriate, shorty. Don't be asking me shit like that. Eva, Eva, Eva. Yeah, she's just a friend. She was just checking in to see what I'm, you know, I was up to. Just a friend. Yeah. I mean, it seemed like a friend thing. <laughs> nah, she's playing. She's playing. She's just a friend. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I just don't want to step on any toes, you know? I'm like, obviously, Crown is my friend. Like, yeah. I, when she texted me earlier, she's like, hey, is it okay if my BF comes and picks up my charger? Uh -huh. And like, to me, I didn't click to me like, oh, is it boyfriend or best friend, you know? So I was like. I mean, you know, we're a thing, I guess. Mm -hmm. Cooked. He cooked you right there, I'm not gonna lie. You're cooked. A thing, like, what does that mean? It's complicated, I was like. Mm. <laughs> you just said it's complicated. Like situation. Is it complicated? Talking, uh, dating. You know, it's like we're on, we're off. Oh, okay, so it's one of those. Yeah. Mm. Cool. So are you guys on right now or off right now? Like, would she care if we hung out tonight? No, I mean, we're just, we're just hanging out. Yeah, but what if- Yeah, we're just hanging out. If, like, something happens, like... <laughs> I don't know if it happens, it happens, you know what I'm trying to say? it's over. How do you take that? What do we listen to? What do we listen for? It's over. I, I don't have any words right now. I mean, at the end of the day, like, none of my business and I can care less, you know? I just, like... No, you care because you wouldn't be asking if you could care less. If you couldn't care less, you wouldn't be asking. Don't want to step on anyone's toes. No, no, we'll be fine. You know, we're just, we're just hanging out. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm just saying, like, you never know what's going to happen. We're going to be, like, in the hot tub. It's like, if we're going to be drinking, I'm not going to let you drive home, you know? Like, you're obviously more than welcome to stay. She's putting up, bro, her game is not being appreciated because he's failing, bro, but she's good. Like, she's good at this. Okay, so she wouldn't care. I didn't say that, but... I didn't say that, but if, that, if that's what you want to go with, I don't know. He knows, he knows he's wrong. Like, mm -hmm. He can't he even say. He doesn't want to answer yeah. that, he can't. I'm just saying, like, I didn't say that she wouldn't care. She probably would care, but it is what it is. Like, we on and off. It's like, it's complicated. So I don't really know how I feel. I don't really pay attention to what other people might be thinking. You know, that's just not my MO. You know, I'm not a, I'm not a mind reader. Never have been, never, never will be. 
you know? So I just worry about what I'm thinking and anything that's not directly communicated, it has nothing to do with me. Can't even say it. If it was my girl saying something like that, bro, oh my God. We going to jail. I mean, I'm going straight to jail. It would be over. It would be over. Okay, well, I'll see you later. But let me look for this charger. I know it's in one of these drawers. Sorry I kept you for so long. Uh, it was, you know, good time, good company. I'm glad. Oh, no, he's, yeah, okay. Here, finally. <laughs> what you came for. Thank you so much. Of course. Oh, wait, is that the one with the, wait, can you see it? Oh, wait, that one's mine. Oh. Man, Ugh. let me check in the room really quickly. This has to be here Some. You can come with me. Can you help me find it? I don't want to keep you much longer. I'm really sorry. Give me all over this. <laughs> you know, alcohol makes you forgetful. Yeah. Let me check over here. I don't know. Where would it be? Where would it be? Look at him. <laughs> Damn. Crown cap. I can't, I can't vouch no more. I was, I thought, I was, I look, he felt like he just didn't like know how to say no and was just very passive because he didn't really make any moves. But now you move a lot. Now you moving walkie. That's just Sean checking Madeline out. This man was not just looking, he was also licking his lips. Maybe it's over here. So Damn, many you take your oh. eyes open for a second, bro. It ain't that deep. Oh, we found it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh, but now that I have you here, really, really quickly, I totally forgot to show you something. Okay. Madeline initially gave Sean the wrong charger so that she could bring him back into the office and show off her merch. With the correct charger now literally in his hands though, he can leave. There is nothing holding him here anymore. Unless, of course, he wants to be here. Okay, sit down. I'm gonna give you a little fashion show. <laughs> okay, he's got the charger. He can now leave. leave. Go home. He doesn't have to stay anymore. That nigga is comfortable. He does not have to stay anymore. He could take him home. So I have two designs. These are just like, like, like tests. Mock-ups. Mock-ups, like, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna show you the, my least favorite. So I have this one. Oh. That one's empty. I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, this is this one. Okay. This one be for the boys. I like it. So I'm Madeline Monet. I know I didn't tell you that earlier. That's is my this real merch? Artist name. It's also my real name, which is, like, really cool. Beautiful name, honestly. Thank you. Okay, you wanna hold it? Check it out. This one is my favorite. This one's custom made though. Okay. This one also says time is Monet, but Uh oh. The Birdman hand rub. He's on BT legs. He's man spreading. He's feeling comfortable. You know. Favorite. This one's custom made though. Okay. This one also says time is Monet. Oh, that's real nice. That's real nice. That's real nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, where? Where the jacuzzi at? You know what I mean? What's up? What you trying? What you trying to do though? Like, what's up? Like, Monet, but it has like a little graphic, yeah, like, like all over. I like that. That for the girls, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's like a mini dress. Well, that's just it is. <laughs> hey, I want my girls to feel bad. You know, like I mean, you listen to my music. It's like. Nah, it's sexy, boss, like sensual, lover girl. It's pretty good. Can I sit? Yeah. Okay. Alright. What? She's oh, sitting on his lap? What the f She's comp though. I ain't gonna lie. She's compy, bro. She dead ass comp. Man. Like the way she's moving is kind of just like. It's like. It's comp. This is why we wanted to give Sean the charger before Madeline ultimately sealed the deal. This man had a chance to leave, and even now he has a chance to push her off, but he doesn't. How do you take this? How would you take it? Hi. So what do you think? Fucking asking me these dumbass questions for it. It always be niggas asking you dumbass shit like 
in moments when you mad. Like, you lose, bro. You lose on the game. Like, bro, you good, bro? Yo, bro, stop talking to me. Stop talking to me. Bro, it's just a game, bro. You good? Nah, niggas want me to tee up. I like it. Like, you know, never eat. Hand right here. The hand right here. The Birdman hand rub. I ain't a down. He ready to... Every way. Yes, I try. I do try. Ah, oh, oh, tears. I don't see no tears. Give me something that's real. Sorry. I do not cry. <laughs> no, you're good. Good. No, you're good. You're good. I'm sorry. In my opinion, there was no point in. Let me see some tears. Let me see some tears. Earn your earn your check. Continuing this any further, tears. I mean, Sean told Madeline that he and Crown were complicated, that they were on and off. He was down to hang out, he was down for whatevers, and I know Madeline was the one that sat down on his lap, but he could at least say something. Instead, he chooses to put his hands on her waist. Yeah. That's way too comfortable. Bro, why the f is he letting her sit on his lap like that? He's enjoying this a bit too much. Oh, he probably thinks they really gonna smash. Bro. This is ridiculous. <laughs> this is just the end. Oh, God. Nah, he do do for sure like that. I don't really have any words right like, now. Oh, this finna be Do you see a free. point in continuing this test to like a... I mean, I mean, like, like at this point, I feel like I, I don't need anything else. Um, I got like. Give me some tears, bro. You wiping away nothing. I think I need it. So. You're not wiping away nothing, bro. I don't see no tears, bro. I don't see no tears. If if this was me, and this was my girl doing this to another nigga, I'm ready to. I'm I I'm taking the mic off. I'm ready to crash out. No. I'm like it. Yeah. I don't care. I, I'm over it. That tissue is dry as shit. Where's the tears at? Yeah. Where are the tears at? <laughs> is it hot here? Like is the uh -huh. Oh yeah, nah. If I'm him, I'm like, oh my gosh, this finna be a breeze. This is a layup. This is what y'all niggas like, right? Y'all like wide open layups? I hate wide open layups. Fine, honestly. Oh, you're fine. Okay. Well, look how he's looking at her, though. That's no. crazy. <laughs> Did you want to have a conversation with him and confront him about everything? Yeah. Still wanted to do that? Yeah, I do. You putting the whole tissue on your eyeball? God damn. Did you still want to do what we talked about in terms of you going out there without the cameras and kind of like interviewing him to see what reaction he gives you first? And then the cameras come out, just so he doesn't like freak out. Yeah. You don't do that. Where the tears okay. at? It's complicated. Where the tears at? Well, so tell me about yourself. Our plan to find out if Sean was cheating with his coworker didn't exactly pan out how we thought it would. However, we did find out that Sean was willing to trade his girlfriend for another girl, which, like I said, he sold his girlfriend for a bowl of beans. Says a lot. I hope you guys have your talkies for this because you guys already know this shit's gonna be good. Remember, it'll be just you until you call out without the cameras. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? What? What, what are you doing, mister? I'm not that tipsy, boy. You can't have your way with me. Nathan, we are ending this here. I will walk you guys when to come in. Okay, perfect. Are these niggas secure? What are these niggas? What is their purpose? Here, I will walk you guys when to come are in. Are these niggas like security or backup just in case the niggas start crashing out? What did? What are y'all here for? Like, y'all just want to see what's going to happen? Like, y'all just here for the tea? Y'all just here to see shit get messy? I mean, I guess. Y'all can keep watching from here. What do y'all need to pull up for? Okay, perfect. Just in case I need to crash out. Madeline? Oh, yeah? Somebody else here? It sounds like it. <laughs> um, you want to come out here? Do you want to? Not really. I'm actually real comfortable right here on this couch. This is a nice couch. I'm actually real comfortable right here. I actually don't want to move. I'm actually good right here. Come on. He's so confused. He has no idea what happened. Hi, boo. What are you doing? That's not the right... That's not the right response. That's not the right response. Come on. I wanted to see y'all. <laughs> yeah. How are you? What's up? Why are you... Are you acting weird? Chilling? How are you? <laughs> chilling. How are you chilling? Why are you over there? I'm here. Come here. Like, I'm good. sit down. Oh, he looks guilty as. Oh, he. 
No. Oh, he's scared. Sit down. Like, what is so... Can I get you a drink, girl? Please. <laughs> so, what's up? What you doing? Like, what's yeah, going on? I just, I just came to get the... Oh, you got my charger. Yeah. Thank you. He's either really confused or he knows exactly what happened. So for t I mean, is there a third option? There's really no other option. 10 minutes. You've been looking all over the house for this and nothing was going on. She's a little dry. I don't know what to tell you. She's your friend. Okay. Hmm. What? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? I just, it's your friend. Like, what is all this the hostility? Like, you're I a little like, defensive right now. Like I don't, I don't even understand. Like, I'm literally, I swear what's, to what's, you, what's I'm the, just trying to understand. The, I am just understand. trying to understand. You told me to come get your charger. Right. I have your, it's right there, right? It is right here. Exactly. So you told me to get your charger. I got your charger. I'm not understanding. I executed. You told me to get your charger. Look, this is your charger. Boom, I got the charger. What do we, anything else that I had to do to get the charger is irrelevant. None of that matters. I got your charger. I did what you asked me to do. That's it. So like, what's the problem? What's well, the problem? the problem is, she could have brought that mother charger to the, to the door. Maybe I feel like it's I'm Ooh, he's using the bitch strategies? He's stealing their tactics? He's stealing their tactics? It's crazy. You're acting really insecure. Bro. Insecure. Oh, he knows. He knows why she's there. He knows. Are you serious? Okay. So, quick question. Quick. Question. I'm just yeah. curious. Let's talk. Are we together, in your opinion? We're a couple, not not wishy washy. Like we are together, we are that a couple. Together, maybe, right? yeah. I don't know. I'm asking you. You don't got to do all that smart ass. Shit. I just want to know if if you think we're together. If you I see us yeah. as I a couple. Yeah. I said yes. <sighs> Why are you interrogating? You should have said no. What's this? You, you told me that. You would have been better off being like, nah. I didn't think we was together. It was a misunderstanding. I thought we was just. I I. I woo -woo. You might have had a better chance. Come get your charger. I'm here. I'm, I'm interrogating you because you're lying. I'm lying. What do you mean I'm lying? Because you're lying to my face. Now you've been lying to my face. I'm, I'm not acting. Are you dating me right now? You got me f***ed up. Her acting insecure. Why didn't you leave? Well, like, I don't gotta answer your question. I mean, like, you're tripping. What is all this? I was sitting on your lap for like five minutes. That's how you operate. I don't know That's how you do it. I didn't do that. And what the f***? Oh, women thinking sometimes, bro. Are you serious? That's I tried right. to give you like multiple chances to just kind of tell me what the f happened. And I told you what And happened. you told me what the f happened, uh -huh. but it was all a lie. And you know how I know it was a f lie? How do you know it was a lie? Because I have a whole entire camera crew watching you. We were watching you the whole time. Alright, let's go. Let's go before somebody. Let's go. Just because I knew you were lying, you know, I like I really wanted to. No, that's cool. But what are the cameras for? Like, you already have him. Everybody's mic'd up and shit. You have cameras everywhere. What is the ambush of the camera crew? You just want me to have anxiety and crash out. You want somebody to just make a mistake. Yo, what the f You've been lying to me. Okay? Bro, also, question, who's who's Ava? What is this? No, Bro, does it matter who Ava is at this point? It don't matter at this point. Did all this, you feel like you did something? What the f is this? I don't feel like I did. You did some like what the f you started from the door like i'm freeing my homegirl first home of all mm -hmm. you're sabotaging her relationship that's what you am i sabotaging or did you, you sabotage sab i mean she did sabotage low-key you, you were the one with I all did. the compliments and touching me nah, bro. touching you first of all what would i have to do touching my friend's boyfriend are you kidding me well, you did it and you have well she well she was touching him though let's she was touching him she was doing all the little pinky and the cute shit and the Sitting on the nigga lap and all that shit. Wait, you are really, you are really sick. But you know what's the, I, you know what's the sad part is that she don't even come, like, in my opinion, she don't even compare to friends, this. boyfriend. She don't are you kidding? Compare to this dark skin girl. You did it. And you I'm really, asking. you are. This dark skin girl, to me, look way better. She look way better in every category, face, body, vibes. Not a, not a white girl do got vibes though, but still, like, she's blowing her out in every category. Hello. Really? You are really sitting here after I Bro, watched get that camera out. No, of no, 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 listen. No, you've been on camera all day. It don't, it, it don't matter at this point. It don't matter. You have, you are sitting here. You are sitting here getting defensive. Because y'all are lying. Getting honestly. defensive as f when I. 
Not yet. I mean, gaslight to continue to gaslight is really your only. I mean, that's not true. You can just you can just you can just stop everything and be like you know what? I'm sorry. I was in the wrong, and you know, try to apologize and whatever. But the gaslighting strategy does work sometimes too, though. I watched you this Bro, entire what? from the moment you walked up to that. Bro, what the f is this? Can y'all stop? Can y'all so stop? <laughs> Can y'all stop? No, we're not stopping. Cause you're cut. So, so Sean, so just so you know, this entire thing was just a loyalty test. Like your girlfriend wanted to find out if you were loyal to her or not. She felt like you were talking to your coworker. She knows about Evelyn, Ava, e Evelyn. She knows about your coworker, Evelyn or something. And she thought that you were obviously cheating on her with Bro, her. Bro, I don't know you like. None of this was real, basically. Everybody was in you on this, basically. Text no, 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 no. No, stop Go set this whole up. Cause you're so foolish. You got me up. You won't even own up and be like, yeah, I f***ed up, bro. Yeah, that's, if it was me, that's what I would have I would have said. I would have been like, you know what? You know, I, you know, I just want to come clean. Even though, like, even though, like, there's no point in you coming clean because you're already caught. That's like the police catching you. It's like, you know what? I want to turn myself in. It's like, bro, we already caught you. It's like, nah, 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 nah. It just... I, I just feel bad, you know, I just want to, I just want to come clean and say, you know, I'm sorry, you know, I just got caught up in a moment, you know what I'm saying, like, you know, she means absolutely nothing to me, like, you know, I love you, and, you know, I, I really hope you can give me a second chance on some Usher shit, on some Usher shit, that's all you can do. What's wrong with you? You won't even own up and say I f***ed up. You're playing f***ing games, like, this I'm is playing bullshit. I'm games. not, like, it wasn't even real, so I wasn't even gonna cheat, like, okay. it's just me. Nah, bro. You <laughs> that nigga was going to. Fuck something. Even gonna cheat. Oh. That What's is cheating. cheating. What is cheating? <laughs> that is cheating. To you? I'm cheating sorry. To you? Cause if I'm sitting on another nigga lap, how does that feel? Oh What's that? So if okay, bet. So if I go okay, bet. So if I go sit on another nigga's lap, What's that? that? Just saying goodbye. Another bet. I'm about to go say goodbye to hella niggas. Bet. You know it's funny when bitches think that dumb fucking other niggas is like affecting me. Like, you fucking these niggas thinking that it's gonna make me mad. That's actually hilarious. I should throw this in your face, bro. I ain't gonna do it because I'm a good person. But you got me hella fed up, bro. Real shit. Nah, y'all look crazy, bro. <sighs> Why are you still there? Get out. So Jeez. if I go sit on another nigga lap. Do what you want. You know, you What's that called? Up, right? So it's like, I guess we're over already. Do what the you want. Here bro, get that camera out of my face for real. You don't gotta be here if you don't want it, Sean. You know, we're no, just... No, you don't gotta be here. Just... Literally, just leave. Oh, I don't get out. I don't even know why the f you are here. Hey, Take this goddamn yeah, stupid yeah, ass charger yeah. too. I don't give a f the charger. You f the charger. Bro, Take the all that. Yeah, 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 bro. Oh, you weird as. You're weird as. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't give a f about no f all y'all. Nigga got me. F oh my god, he got me so fed up. Oh my god. I if he was sincere about it, he was like, okay, you know, like I did f up. This That's what I'm saying. He could have. He could have. He could have. Bro, he could have saved it, bro. Even even though it was all on camera, even though we all saw that he was grabbing on her butt, eyeing her down, licking his lips, texting bitches, doing all types of weird shit, even though he was caught red-handed, he's like, you know what, babe? Damn, like, you know, I just hit him with the face cover. You know, I just, you know, I'm so sorry, and I, and I you know, I'm so sorry that I, I put you through all of this. I'm so sorry that... You know, I got you, you know, in a position where you even feel like you need to do this. You know what I'm saying? Like, that hurt me, for real. Like, I really feel some type of way that I got you in this position where you feel like you got to do this. And, um, you know, I'm sorry. Like, you know, no, no offense to you, but, you know, you mean nothing to me. You know, it's just I got caught up in a moment. You know, I didn't have no self-control, and, and I'm sorry. You know, and I, and I really wish... And hope that you can give me another chance and you know we can start this thing over you feel what i'm saying like he could have saved it this happened okay that's one thing you know what i mean but for you to try to make me feel stupid after you did all that like you look stupid oh my god i'm so high oh my goodness